scriptures talk about a blessedness that happens to a man whose delight is in the law of God. So as someone says, it says, but his delight is in the law of God. And doth he meditate day and night. He says that that man is like a tree planted by the rivers of water, whose leaves do not wither, when he bears fruit in every season. As you are about listening to this message, we believe that your life is going to be like that man planted by the rivers of water. Your leaves are forever going to bear. And we know that your, your season will not pass by. You will forever shine and you will forever bear fruit. We have a lot of content to share with you. So we would entreat you to subscribe to this channel as well as like us. Hit that notification bell to receive more updates from us because we know that whatever content here is going to set you on calls at every time. It's going to make you attain whatever stature that Christ wants you to attain. Thank you. Bring out your prayer request. Unto thee that answers prayer shall all flesh come. We are going to pray. Let me tell you something. We have seen dramatic breakthroughs. It's a revelation that God gave. We are not just writing requests for nothing. People's destinies have changed. God has wiped the tears of families and individuals. Hallelujah. I'd like you to hold your prayer request and in one minute cry and say, Lord, everything, everything written must be turned to a testimony. Not some. Lord, I thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's not too late to write. Those following online, make sure you have your request. He said, make your request known. Make your request known. Don't assume it is known. Make your request known. Lord, everything. 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 One by one. One by one. By the power that raised Christ from the dead, one by one, by the unction, the anointing that is in this house tonight. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Please keep it down and lift your voice and everything you do not want to see in your life, begin to release it to leave you right now. Before we pray, everything, everything, everything you are tired of seeing in your life. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Expect to be healed. Expect to be delivered. Let me tell you something. Deliverance is very powerful when it is done scripturally and is done biblically because it's a separation between men and the forces that cause their problems. There are forces that are responsible for the problems, the challenges in people's lives. There are, there are forces. There are forces. 
And in a few minutes from now, we are going to begin to pray. I tell you, fire will burn in this place. Fire will burn in this place. And no devil will be able to stand. There are people whose lives must change. That's why we came. That's why we came. That's why we came. That's why we came. One more prayer point and I'll begin to minister. Every spirit responsible for my pain, you are under arrest tonight. Lift your voice and pray. Every spirit. Every spirit responsible for my failures, responsible for the limitation in my life. Hallelujah. Please lift your hands, everybody. Don't say anything, just lift your hands. Please, everybody, if you can. If you, if you are doing something that doesn't allow you, that's all right. But please lift your hand. Don't allow the devil cheat you in this time, please. Don't allow the devil cheat you. When you hear me ministry, minister like this, is because I'm under the anointing of the Spirit. These are not things I'm doing of my own accord. It is the foolishness of spiritual things that produce results. Keep your hands lifted. Keep your hands lifted. The first set of people that God will step into right now are people that God is breaking. I'm seeing, I'm seeing God break delay. I'm seeing chains on people's legs. And the Lord said, just lift your hands and he will locate them by himself. So keep your hands up. Father, I have done what you have told me to do. Right now, inside and outside. Right now. Right now, inside and outside. I stretch my hands. Bring them out. Right now. Everyone whose feet has been chained. Kaparataka. Bareketebo bo supaya. I unloose those chains now. I untie those chains now. I untie those chains right now. Bring them out. The second overflow. God is touching a lady so dramatically. Delay, 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 delay. You can't stand the anointing tonight. You can't stand the anointing tonight. Oh, there is grace in this house to challenge every altar of delay that has tied down the lives and the destinies of people. You must go forward. You must go forward. You must go forward. You must go forward. It's time to move forward. It's time to move forward. Keep your hands lifted. I'm seeing altars on fire. And the Lord said it belongs to families. Lord, where are the families? Right now. Right now. Let the fire of God locate them. Right now. Where are these families? I stand by this anointing. And I command everywhere across this building. Every family under the siege of witchcraft. Every family under the siege of witchcraft. Fire comes upon that altar. fire comes upon that altar God is saving people right now the power of the Holy Ghost is at work in this place. You can't be the same. You can't be the same. Hallelujah.
Keep your hands down. God is doing a quick work. Only ladies, lift your hands. Only ladies, lift your hands. Please lift your hands. Ladies represent gates in the spirit. And there are destinies whose gates have been closed. Right now, I'm about to speak in the name of Jesus. Upon every lady here, upon every lady here, who the gate has been closed. I command right now, be open, be open, be open. Many of you will be surprised what will happen to you right now. Sisters, you represent gates, 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 young and old, young and old. May those gates be open now. 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 Every high thing must come down. Every stronghold shall be broken. You wear the victor's crown. You overcome. You overcome. Every high thing must come down. Every stronghold shall be broken. You wear the victor's crown. You overcome. You overcome. Every high thing must come down. Every stronghold shall be broken. You wear the victor's crown. Lift your hands. The Lord is showing me something very. I've prayed about this in one miracle service. There are people here whose destinies have been exchanged for others. I pray right now, wherever they are, at least 40 people, 40 people, wherever they are right now, I command a reversal. I command a reversal. Fire, fire, fire falls upon people. Fire every destiny that has been exchanged in the realm of the spirit. Every destiny that has been exchanged in the name of Jesus. Every load you are carrying that is not yours in the name of Jesus, it returns back to the sender. I think must come down Every stronghold shall be broken You wear the victor's crown You overcome, you overcome Every high thing must come down Every stronghold shall be broken You wear the victor's crown You overcome, you overcome Hallelujah I tell you miracles are happening here mighty mighty miracles mighty miracles mighty miracles all those out here all the spirits tying down your destinies at the count of three this is miracle service they live now. I speak in the realm of the spirit. One, two, go, go, go. Out of them. Out of them. Go forever. Release their destinies. Chains be broken. Release their destinies. Hallelujah. Let me tell you something. No spirit will hide today. The power of God is strong in this place to bring strange visitations. Lift your hands, everyone. There are men. 
it's not just that you are delayed you are not even moving at all i want to pray and the prayer i'm praying now is an unction that will begin to move people forward an unction that will begin to move people forward but first the strong man that has kept families down must be dislodged lift your hands i pray right now whoever is under the influence of any spirit and any power that is causing any retrogression and non-progress right now as i pray fire comes upon them in the name of jesus inside and outside take the fire now take the fire now take the fire now hallelujah hallelujah i'm seeing someone they brought here i don't know if the person has a mental problem or is mad is there someone like that there's someone they brought like a mental problem mad a mad person where is the person bring the person it's time for a miracle this is a mad person Every high thing must come down. Every stronghold shall be broken. You were the victor's crown. You were the crown. You were the crown. Every high thing must come down. Every stronghold shall be broken. You were the victor's crown. You were the crown. You were the crown. Hallelujah. I'm seeing a man that they brought here. It's like he has a problem walking very well. Is there someone like that? It's like he has a problem walking very well. A man, I don't know if there's pains or is that he cannot walk completely. Is there such a person, please? We have to hurry up. I want us to finish in good time. Is there such a person? Hold on. Let me just, is there such a person? Outside. He can't walk. He can't walk. He's paralyzed. Huh? What? Who brought him? Come, come quickly, please. What's the situation? What's the situation? Sir, it's as loud as you can. Joseph Reason, last week I visited him then at Kano with his wife, and they informed us in the village that he's paralyzed. This man is a policeman. Is he a policeman? No, we I'm seeing his cardigan for from Kano. So we okay. The, he's a custom I'm seeing him where okay. The What's wrong with him now? Presently now can he, he hear me? We can hear you, sir. Boy. Can okay. talk and have Look at me. Can you hear me? No, no, hold on. Can you hear me? Where are you from? Yeah, from Kano, sir. Kano, you yes. came from Kano? Yes, yeah, sir. Look at me, sir. In the name of Jesus Christ, look at me. Since when could he not walk? Wife, come, please. This is your husband for how long? This is almost a month now. But the leg is just two weeks now. The legs is two weeks? Yes. It's okay. I'm seeing stroke in the name of Jesus Christ. Sir, look at me. Look at me. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? The first miracle is for him to hear what I'm saying. Something has affected his mind. He cannot even hear. Huh? He can't even talk. He can't hear. He can't talk. In the name of Jesus Christ, I command that deaf and dumb spirit to leave you. To leave you. Sir, look at me. Look at me. Can you hear how, sir? Huh? Look at me. Can you look at me? Try to move your legs. Can you? Can you try to move your legs? Can you try to do what I'm doing? Try to move your legs. 
Talk to him that I want to pray for him. Who is this? Pastor David. Why are they here? Hold on, please. Uh, 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 uh. Let please only the case I call. Don't just we are going to pray for people. What's wrong? What's wrong? This lady is mad. Yes. Since he, when? Yes. Who knows you, madam? He, he, are, are you in Zaria here? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Her case is mental. Now I started there. They decided to call hospital. Now get, the thing, the thing they, they do. It's like epilepsy. It is like epilepsy, so it affected her brain. Yes. You can imagine. Hold my hands. Father, I command that spirit to leave. Mad spirit, go now. You will let this girl go in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Out of her now. Out! Thank you, Jesus. Just lie her down. She's going to get up. Sir, I'm, I'm looking at this man and I'm seeing witchcraft because I'm looking at a man who is already dead. Not even that he's dying. Somebody that they've already killed. He's already dead. Get a chair and keep him. Let him sit down and you pray. What you guys will do is just try to talk to him. I need him to hear what I'm saying because I want him to lift his leg. Can he see me? Madam, you are his wife. You will, you will help us eh? and be talking to him. Give him a seat, please, so that we don't waste time. Daddy, you're welcome, sir. From where, sir? What's the issue? Who brought him out? I came with my neighbors. What's the issue, sir? Okay, is the mic working? Is the mic working, Lawrence? His mic. Sir, can you hear me? I can hear Please you. Please come. I'm looking at you and I'm seeing a problem. Um, have you gone to the hospital, sir? You've gone to the hospital. Yeah, I've gone to the hospital. Who has glaucoma? It's me. You. You are yes. the one who has glaucoma. Yes, sir. Because I'm seeing a writing on your head and it's written glaucoma. Yes, sir. That you have glaucoma. Yes, sir. This problem started like eye problem. Yes, sir. Then it moved to your hands. Yes, and now it's on your leg. Yes, sir. And it's like stroke. Yes, you will be healed right now. Amen. The Lord himself Amen. is going to perfect Amen. you. Amen. Daddy. Hold this mic. Shout say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I declare. I declare. Now. Now. Stroke. Stroke. Live my life. Live my life. Blindness. Blindness. Live my life. Live my life. Now. now. In Jesus' name. In Jesus Please come name. up and jump. Come. Come up. Come up. Come up. Go ahead. Do what you believe. Do. do what you believe. Do. do what you believe. Come. Walk. Also has an eye condition. Please look, sir. Can you see people? I can see people. Could you see them before? Yeah, but I can't recognize them. You can't recognize them. But now, can you recognize them? I can see them, but not fully recognition. Sir? Not fully recognition. No full recognition. The Lord has started something in his life. He could not. I mean, glaucoma, and then down to stroke. You can see him still limping. Daddy, in the name of Jesus, you came with somebody. Where's the person? Who came with him? You are wearing a white scarf on your head. Who is that? Is there someone like that? Come. You are the one. Is this your father? No, sir. My neighbor. Your what? My neighbor. Oh, that is she's your neighbor. We are going to pray. And then God will bless you a thousand times. I'm going to pray for you. Daddy. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. The power of the enemy. The power of the enemy. Over my life. Over my life. Will not die. Will not die. Be made whole right now in the name of Jesus. Please exercise yourself and go in your liberty. The Lord perfects your body in the name of Jesus Christ. And for you, I'm going to pray for you by the power of the Holy Spirit. Help her, please, in the name of Jesus. How can a, a lady like this, planning her life like any other person, now this girl is mad. You look at this. This is real madness. It's not like 
is a child's play. Eh? She came back from the office on Monday, then she started reacting. She came back from the office she mad. Said, yeah. You see, let me tell you, look at this. It's one thing to leave your house quietly. The Bible says there are arrows. She came back from the office when? On Monday. And then I heard just, can you imagine? You got up and went to work and came back mad. This is the world we live in. Are we together now? Let me tell you, wickedness is very, 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 very real. Very real. Very real. Mama, that woman in, on yellow, please come. I don't know you, but the Lord is saying that your joy needs to be restored. One. Two. Why am I seeing you? There's a line between you and that lady with red. This one holding your hands. What is the relationship between two of you? Come. He's my friend. She's your friend. You came together. Yes. I'm seeing a light left you and to her. And then the Lord is saying, I should pray for you because it's the same thing two of you are going through. We have to pray for you. Number one, your joy. Your joy needs to be restored. And then number two, your health. You are feeling pain in your stomach. I have to pray for you so that they will tell you five words. Mm -mm, Madam, let me talk to you now. Did you tell me miscarriage? Because I'm seeing something growing. Huh? And it's paining you. And this thing will make you to be bleeding unusually. It's fibroid. You are bleeding unusually. And this thing is not just miscarriage. Because for the miscarriage, a man appears to you in the night. And once you see that man, the next thing is you have miscarriage. But we are going to pray. Madam, can I pray for you? Where are you from? Ben. Benway. Ben, I stay in Zara. You stay in Daraka. Let me pray for you. Madam. The Lord needs to restore your joy because there are things I cannot say here, but one of your major requests is the fruit of the womb. Is that true? The fruit of the womb. And I see you even praying that if possible, let God give you twins. Yes, sir. Is that true? Yes, sir. And you are asking that the Lord will give you twins. Yes, sir. And I'm going to pray for you because those twins will pray that God will give Amen. you twins. You believe it? I'm not a herbalist. Lay your hands on your stomach. We have to pray. There's a man that appears to you. This is demonic. In the name of Jesus and by the blood of the eternal covenant, I set you free from all this nonsense around your life. In the name of Jesus. Ma, I pray for you. You desire children. God will not just give you children. May he give you twins. In the name of Jesus. And that formation of fibroid in your body, we cause it right now. You are feeling like fire is moving around your stomach. In the name of Jesus Christ, a supernatural miracle for you. In the name of Jesus, let me pray for you. Ah, you're not married. Are you married? Um, because I, I wanted to pray the same thing and the Holy Ghost is telling me you are not married, but you are about to marry. There's somebody in your life. He has engaged you. Eh? Is that true? Yes, sir. Who is the person? He has engaged. Is that true? You are engaged to marry. So I have to pray for you. Hi. My sister, don't be offended though. There's serious witchcraft in your family. I'm seeing this witchcraft coming from... Where is Otuko? In eh? Benue State. What do you have to do with Otuko? There's one of my own people. But me, I'm from Otuka. Mm -mm. Just answer what I'm telling you. What do you have to do with Otuko? Who is there? He's my uncle. Father, in the name of Jesus, your marriage will be successful. Look at me. I don't know how you will do this, but don't allow them to do anything on you that is demonic in the name of marriage. I'm seeing something that has to do with you and a tree. Just, I don't know what I'm saying, but be careful. In the name of excitement of traditional marriage, they initiate people into nonsense and rubbish. I pray that the Lord will help you. In the name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen and amen. Please lift your hands. I want to pray. Um, God wants to do a very spectacular miracle in this place right now. There is someone here you completely cannot see with your right eye completely cannot see with your right eye but a miracle is going to happen right now 
completely cannot see with your right eye wherever that person is in the name of Jesus I command that you begin to see with that eye now I command that you begin to see with that eye now I command that you begin to see with that eye now please check yourself very quickly check yourself very quickly while we're doing that there are there are a number of people and when I pray for you if you get healed and you, and you, you find out that you're in that category just come out quickly let's save time I want to pray for people right now I'm seeing people who have been having severe pain around the chest region like your heart yes some of you when you wake up in the morning severe pain severe pain the Lord is healing those people right now right now please check yourself and if you see a miracle run out here there is a miracle happening to somebody right now check yourself severe pain are along the heart region miracles are happening right now right now as I speak only those who are healed of this miracle make your way to the front I see a miracle happening to somebody right now make your way to the front celebrate them they are coming celebrate them they are coming Jesus is touching people your chest I see a miracle around the heart region very quickly please save our time Jesus is killing people right now Vinonia is this how you celebrate miracles celebrate miracles celebrate miracles celebrate miracles celebrate miracles celebrate miracles the chest area there is power in the name of Jesus there is power in the name of Jesus to break every chain break every chain hallelujah check it right now is there any pain is there any pain no, sir. Like, look at the boy is even crying how long quickly just testify one minute quickly turn face the crowd quickly like, it's okay you don't have to cry up to more than four years the pain come as if when i'm breathing when you are breathing you feel the pain and right I'm now close. check it do what you couldn't do completely no pain in the name of jesus that miracle never returns to you again mama any pain let's take a few tests no pain completely for how long has it been it has been there for years for more than five three more than five years yes, please yes. check it now we want you to confirm look at this look at this completely the pain is gone the anointing is even on her help her please help her how long my dear please those who have been healed just come here quickly we'll give you some just turn face the crowd very quickly organize yourselves please ushers help them how long has it been what's your name and how long about three years ago how is the pain like what is describe it for us very quickly I don't worry she's, she's after, just here be after patient I eat, after i eat food, uh -huh. then, I'll restore my then you'll chest. be struggling your chest is it is there pain now yeah. is there pain check it make sure you are telling the truth if you lie, we'll clap for you, but you are the one who will suffer. Praise God. May the Lord bless you in the name of Jesus. All of you, all of you healed of that pain. Lift your hands. Let me pray for all of you right now. In the name of Jesus. Supernatural miracle, it never returns. 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 Give Jesus praise in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Give Jesus praise in the mighty name of Jesus. My goodness. I just saw a spectacular miracle in the realm of the spirit. There is someone here who has just been healed of pile. Please check it. I want you to come and testify. You will be very surprised. Pile has just been healed right now. Right now, supernaturally. Pile has been healed. Please, if you can check yourself, I would like you to check yourself. Let someone check you so that it is not a lie. Pile with intense pain. And God is healing that person right now check yourself and when you check yourself please let me have the person come forward and then we'll come and testify and god will give you a dramatic 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 miracle pile make sure you check and let the person come out in the name of jesus there is a lady at overflow too not the first one the other overflow um your name is blessing your name is blessing Please, if there is such a lady like that, can you quickly run before we 
start ministering to cast out every devil and pray for the sick god is touching people please the person with pile go and check yourself a lady with the name blessing you are wearing white white jack like sweater is there somebody like that blessing outside overflow too where is she coming from please always confirm where are you coming from the other overflow what's your name blessing where's where are you from hold my hands god is going to give you a miracle and he's also delivering your family your family needs deliverance huh your family needs deliverance hold my hands for god to have located you is because he loves you be set free right now in the name of the lord jesus christ in the name of the lord jesus christ in the name of the lord jesus christ i'm hearing the name of someone and you are my namesake your name is joshua you are outside please come in you are outside come in god is bringing deliverance to this lady and her family in the name of the lord jesus christ in the name of the lord jesus christ in the name of the lord jesus christ a supernatural miracle god is bringing deliverance for her family they will never be the same there are four of you that are supposed to be here with this name four of you please stand here all of you hallelujah i'm going to pray for you come god is going to use you huh god is going to use you mightily i'm going to pray for you my friend you you love god but god needs to help you huh do you hear how sir kajiko you have bad friends we're going to pray for you huh in the name of jesus sir look at me god is going to help you who is a trader in your family mother eh? my mother what does she trade my mother God wants to change her story. Amen. Hold my hands. You are going to start having strange revelations and an anointing is going to come upon your life. Right? As I'm speaking to you now, an angel of the Lord, you will feel something like a crown being put on your head. It's a mantle. It doesn't mean you should just go and start ministry, but it's to tell you that God will use you very mightily. Father, confirm your word in his life will never be the same in the name of the lord jesus christ tell your mother that a prophecy has come for the family that god is about to lift the family are you hearing what i'm saying and you look like an ordinary person but you are going to hold a lot of money in your hand there is an unction there is grace for finances upon you there is grace for finances upon you where's Ejimi, please he's going to go let him lay his hands on you there's grace for finances that will come upon you and you will never be the same. I have to pray for you. You love God, but you are in here, you are out here, you have bad friends. Come, follow me. Your friends are not good people. Where are you? Where are you? You are in Samaru here? Yes, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. You love God? Yes, sir. Is it too much of a price to leave your bad friends? It's too much. Ah. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray because God wants to use you as a savior to your family. Are we together? But you see, hold on, please. Let me talk to you. If you really want to be great in life, it doesn't matter whether you grew up with the same people. You must have the courage to tell some people, I love you. I'm not, I don't have a problem with you. But since you are not just going my direction, let me tell you, you can't play games with God. And, and, and you, God is not a herbalist that you pray abracatabra with. If you are serious with God, then go for him. Are we together? I love you. And in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray that every spirit of rebellion will live your life. In the name of Jesus. There is... Hmm, this is... This is I don't know why God is giving me this kind of instructions here. Please don't feel embarrassed. There are two boys and one lady. Two gentlemen and one lady here. You need to be prayed for. You have an uncontrollable appetite for stealing. Please don't be embarrassed. Ordinarily, I would not ask you to go out. There are two of them. It's not like you're a bad person. Anything you see, you must carry. One lady and two guys. Please come out. 
we are just going to give one minute there are so many things we need to do this is a revelation God is giving me please this is a family of faith we are not saying you are a thief but this has brought so much trouble to you please whether you are inside or outside don't be embarrassed there is a lady in this list and there are two gentlemen wherever you are please as you hear the word of the lord make your way to the front you need to be delivered you have tried to stop using willpower it's an addiction you don't use willpower to end supernatural things make your way to the front and i'll be glad to pray with you make your way there's somebody like that i'm i want to pray for this guy but god is saying i should wait for that case there's somebody like that let's celebrate him you are the one there's one more gentleman and a lady one more gentleman and a lady please there's nothing to be ashamed of this is a family of faith please very quickly just one minute there's there's so many other things we have to do sata stealing no matter what happens you can't stop it where's the other brother please don't delay us it doesn't take time to know you have this problem because it's a challenge that you've been trying to solve let me tell you something you see ba these things are spirits it's not whether you are a thief or not if it comes upon you it will make you act that way you may not even use what you are carrying but you will still carry it anyway please where is the last person don't delay us let's pray come let me pray for you before I pray for them. The last person, quickly, summon the courage to come and join them very quickly so that I can minister to you. The Lord will anoint you. The Lord is saying, I should tell you, he's restoring your family. Huh? Where are you from? I don't know why God is visiting Benway State today. Where are you from? From Benway State. God is visiting Benway people in very strange ways. It's like the miracle service is for Benway people. Benway people. There's a lady self from Benway who is going to be under the anointing now. As a testament of this thing I'm saying. Hi, this God. I don't know. I don't know. This is my God. Make sure she's from Benway. Where is she from? No, 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 no. Don't, don't worry. Don't feel embarrassed, my dear. I love you and I'm very proud of you. Right? Look at me. Can you go? Come. You love God, but there's one boy around you. Send him a text this night that Joshua Selman said he should never come around you again. Hmm? Don't feel bad. This, this, I'm not, I don't hate people, but number one, this boy is a, is a small boy. He doesn't even know what he's doing. Two, um, please, there are things I cannot say here. Huh? Are you ready for a child now? Huh? Yes. She's saying yes. Uh, no. Okay, well, who knows? I mean, Mary was 14 years when she had Jesus. So, please, but on a, on a serious note, huh? you love God, you are a serious lady, but there's something on you that makes bad boys. Bad boys, the moment they see you, you look at them, you look at their eye, you know that they are not serious Christians and they keep coming to you. But there's one that's been disturbing you. Send him a text and say, Joshua Selman said, please, please, he, he should come for, bring him for Koinonia next week. Let God help him. Yes, instead of driving him, let God help him. Are we together? So I'm going to pray for you. Listen, there are many more people who are bigger thieves that have refused to come out. Are we together? So don't ever be embarrassed. You see, when you ever point one finger at people, make sure that others, be sure that others are pointing at you. I want to pray for you so that you will be free. In the name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen and amen. Where is our Benway lady? Careful, please bring her. I want to use her to speak a prophetic word. There was a time it was Kogi, right? Remember. So today God has decided, hold my hands. No, 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 the other hand. I want to pray. Watch what happens now. It's called signs and wonders. These ones are not miracles. They are signs and wonders. They are faith boosters. 
the Lord is with this lady visiting Benway people right now. Visiting Benway people right now. Right now. God is visiting Benway people. Those altars now. Now. In the name of Jesus, the Son of the living God. Every territory of Benway that has tied the lives of people down. I hold this lady as a point of contact. Inside and outside. The anointing of God will fish them out by power. I command those altars. Those altars. You come under siege tonight. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. You get the glory. You get the praise. You take the honor. I just want to say thank you. You get the glory. You get the praise. You take the honor. Listen. You will watch all these people come to testify. They may not even know what is happening to them. You are not just falling for nothing. And you don't even have to fall. For it to show that something is happening in your life. But there are visitations that God is giving people. Grace in your life and your family. In the name of Jesus, I pray for you. I command that spirit to leave you forever. No appetite for stealing. Not only is God delivering you from stealing, lust leaves you now. In the name of Jesus. Every lust leaves you now in the name of Jesus. My brother... I command a miracle for you right now give me your hands in the name of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus Christ there's somebody here you stole fuel you stole fuel and this thing brought a problem but you kept quiet it's a spirit God wants to set you free please don't feel embarrassed fuel like um foil pms i don't know if it's you know foil for something i don't know what it's for but you you found yourself stealing that foil to do something with it i don't know what it's for please i want to pray for you because the person you took that thing from pronounced a curse are we together please that's why i want to pray for you we have to pray right now and then i'll, I'll minister to the sick please if there is such a person i want you to come out or maybe someone you know there's nothing to be embarrassed about you're seeing us praying for people you stole fuel it may not be that you are a bad person you see fundamentally people are not bad situations pressures and spirits make people act in certain ways that may look disdainful and embarrassing you must be spiritual to be able to love people in spite of their flaws are we together there's somebody like that oh there's somebody like that the holy ghost is still speaking to me there's somebody like that please have the courage to come forward as we begin to pray don't meet me after the service please there is grace and unction to pray for you right now this has to do with fuel that you carried i don't know whether you sold it or you gave it to someone or something like that but then we have to pray for you 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 everyone lift your voice no, God is saying I should stop till the person comes out. Who is the person, please? My brother, look at me. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not um, embarrassing you, right? It's the flesh that causes this embarrassment. But you see, when God shines light on you, it's not unto condemnation. Are we together? He said, he who does not have sin should cast the first stone. So we are not people who come and embarrass people and condemn them. The person you took the foil put a curse upon you. And the curse is that nothing you enter will stay in your hand. And that's what I want to take away from your life. That's why I brought you out. Are we together now? In the name of Jesus Christ. It took a man to pronounce this curse. Be free now. By the power of the Holy Ghost. I command that it leaves you forever. 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 I take away that pronouncement from your life. In the name of Jesus, you love the Lord with all your heart and you walk in his ways. God bless you. Please stand up and go. Hallelujah. 
I'm about to minister to the sick right now, very quickly. And while I do, you can you can just bring the lady to the front. I'm still praying for her. Hallelujah. Sister, talk to her. Sister, my dear, look at me. Look at me. How are you? How are you? Are you fine? What's wrong with you? You don't know. That's how she has been. Oh, that's how she behaves. She hears you. She actually hears you when you speak, but she won't be able to respond. Do you know why? She's not wicked. She's under bondage, and we're going to pray for her. Right? There's a reason why I ask you to keep her here. I keep laying my hands on her. From work, she came back. I'm praying. I don't know who did this thing, but in the name of Jesus, as he's leaving you, it will land on that person's head. Some of you don't like the prayer I'm praying. I say it again. Whoever brought this, it must land on the head of the person. It's because they didn't do it to your sister or to your brother. That's why. You leave your office and return mad. What if she's the breadwinner of her family? That whole family has come under siege. Let me pray before we, let me prophesy to you before we pray. In the name of Jesus, any human agent who has partnered with the realm of the spirit to bring the pain in your life, I pray this night is a night of judgment for them. This night is a night of judgment for them. I say it again. This night is a night of judgment for them. This night is a night of judgment. I command judgment for them. I command judgment for them. Judgment for them judgment for them any human agent i say it responsible for your pain i command judgment for them while we ask the sick people to come out please if you came here trusting god for healing now is your moment while they are doing that please let's have all the prayer requests just something has happened to her just carry her and put her aside somewhere make your way to the front quickly please organize yourself now is the time for healing very quickly while they are doing that please all of you write your request listen hold on please i allow you to switch off your switch on your phones if you need to and call your loved ones to forward their request for you please you can type it quickly and send it here it's not enough that you've written your request please if you even know the requests of some others you can write it and put their names because we are going to pray for those requests hallelujah you move mountains you cause walls to fall help me you perform miracles there is nothing Standing only because you one more time do you move mountains you cause walks to fall with your power you perform me there is nothing that's impossible Worship team, you are going to help us. Look how many people have come to be healed. I thank God because God has found a place where he can communicate his healing power to his people. Now, we are going to be very, very fast. This is not for the rest of us to be distracted. Everyone, you should be writing your prayer request and you should be praying. Because after this session, there is going to be a massive impartation. There is, there is need for grace and unction for us. And so we're going to pray. Hey, Jimmy, please come help me. We're going to be praying for the sick. Please, listen. 
it doesn't matter who prays for you whether myself or Ejimi there's a corporate anointing okay so we're praying for you um, the moment they pray for you don't leave one line and come and join another one just a touch you don't even have to say what is wrong with you if we ask you that's all right if we don't please if there's a prophetic word you will be giving if you are not giving any word some of you when I touch you you now get angry because I didn't prophesy look let me tell you something this thing you don't do it just the way you want to do at least not for me are we together so it has if there is no word for you just believe and then when hands are laid on you don't just go back to your seat smiling check yourself do what you couldn't do before if you have to go to the hospital then you should go to the hospital for test are we together and if there are still people sitting down and not coming out because of the crowd please make sure you join them there is a reason why we lay hands like this i don't do this in other meetings but then so that we can make contact worship team help us do the best you can god bless you father let there be miracles in the name of jesus christ hold on hold on please how many months pregnant are you eight months we have to pray i'm seeing them cutting you cs but we have to pray for you they gave me the list they gave you the list do you believe God can turn things around? Yes. Cry. There is a God that we serve. Immediately I looked at you. I saw them cutting you with a knife. Huh? Don't cry. I don't know what the doctor said, but in the name of Jesus Christ, by the power of the Holy Ghost, in the name of Jesus, there will be a miracle for you. The baby will adjust to his normal position and he will come out the way he should come out like the hebrew women in the name of jesus christ a supernatural miracle is happening to you right now in the name of jesus god bless you go ahead god bless you when i pray for you go back to your seat in the name of jesus christ be healed right now heal now standing here not knowing a miracle for you in the name but holding on to faith you know best in the name of Jesus healing for you nothing miracle can you. catch you by surprise you got this figured out and you're watching us now and when you look as if we can Sing your arms and step in And everything we need you supply You've got this in control Now we know that you made a way When a box were against the wall and it looked as if it was over You, you made a way And we're standing here Breakthrough, 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 breakthrough You, you came for it, breakthrough way. You are entering the realm of breakthrough Supernatural breakthrough Not just healing but breakthrough By the you power of the Holy Ghost I open the doors right now In the name of Jesus and we're standing help, help, help here the child, please. only because you made help and we're standing here carry the baby please only because you made and we're standing here only because please, you if someone made. if someone is backing a baby as they are laying hands on the person ushers please help so that because you move the mountains Lord, you move the mountains. Lord, you move the mountains. Lord, you move the mountains. Yeah. And you call the walls to fall.
Jesus. Lord, you move the mountains. You flow the walls to flow through with your power. With your power. Lord, with your power. Hallelujah. Everyone say after me in the name of Jesus. Please shout it. The meeting is still on. In the name of Jesus. I declare that every power that wants to stop my testimony, the Lord rebuke you. Lift your voice and begin to pray. Lift your voice and begin to pray. You are doing yourself good when you are praying. You are doing yourself good when you are praying. You must testify. They are singing that every power, every high thing must come down. So you pray. Let her go now. Out! 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 Go! Are you praying? my turn to testify in this season and every power that will stop me from testifying I come against it in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus hallelujah say after me in the name of Jesus come on shout it inside and outside in the name of Jesus every legal access that the devil has over my life and over my family by the blood of Jesus that access is broken lift your voice and pray 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 every access please make sure you are praying this is part of the meeting Every legal access the devil has over my life by the blood of the eternal covenant, by that which Christ has done on the cross, I come against it in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Say in the name of Jesus. My door to the next level. Hear the word of the Lord. Be open now. Lift your voice and pray. Command that door to open. The access point to the next level of my life and destiny. I command you to be open. I command you to be open. Revelation 3 verse 8. I have set before you an open door. 
no man can shut it are you praying shake it take it take it take it break it take it it us break it take a lot of other books man prakata barato ko so break it take it boss ente praska la barriquetes si que te la 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 boss rapa caparoto so break it take it take it take it take it break it take it On your feet as well. Stretch your hands on this prayer request. Lord, it must be turned to a testimony. Lift your voice and pray. I'm praying on your request. There is a covenant of answered prayer in this house. We invoke that covenant. My covenant will I not break nor alter the thing which is gone from from my lips shake it take it take it break it take it so break it is and break it is shake it take it man broke it take it take it take it take it take it break it so to break it Lord have respect for the covenant in this house let there be miracles let there be miracles let there be miracles let there be miracles supernatural miracles breakthroughs 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 shebo koto pekete ekete koto shoto koto makata pakata rekete rekoto so pekete kete kete Miracle so God. Miracle so God. Hallelujah. Join me, shout a loud amen in the name of Jesus. Is that the best in the name of Jesus? The Bible says, Unto thee that answers prayer shall all flesh come. Parakatakata. I tell you, fire is burning in this place. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, every request that has been dropped before the God of heaven, we turn it into a testimony now. We turn it into a testimony now. Be turned into a testimony now. Be turned into a testimony now. Between now and the next miracle service, strange answers, strange answers, strange answers, strange answers. The way I'm walking upon this prophetically, in the name of Jesus, that's how you will walk upon every challenge. I step upon it prophetically. Everything that has mocked God, as I step upon it, as help them please, as I step upon it by prophecy, I decree in the name of Jesus that that's how you rise above the challenges. Hallelujah. Lift your hands. There will be a drastic impartation here right now. Just five minutes and we're done. Drastic impartation. Listen. The anointing that is coming upon you is 
an anointing upon your gift it's time for what you carry to speak lift your hands everyone in the name that is above all names at the count of three my god a massive impartation one two three take it take it take it receive that impartation upon your gift that impartation all over this building is yours for the taking it's yours for the taking produce results produce results produce results hallelujah listen the unction for supernatural results in the name of jesus that your results are not ordinary i stand by this apostolic and prophetic office and i command at the count of three let it fall like rain supernatural results one two get ready three take it take it take it take it supernatural ministry supernatural business supernatural family oh, oh, oh. help me Of results you have not seen in your life your business and your ministry I prophesy to you go and produce that result from today go and produce that result from today from today I prophesy it I program it upon your spirit go and catch fire whatever has refused to work in your life you have tried and tried and it has refused to work by this unction tonight we force it to work in the name of jesus hear me all those trusting god for jobs you have done everything you know to do the door is not opening in the name that is above all names go and get your miracle job go and get your miracle job Go and get your miracle job. Every family going through stress and tension. You don't even know what to do. I pray right now. The force responsible for the pain in your family. Tonight, judgment upon them judgment upon them judgment upon them judgment upon them hear me every idea every concept you need to rise to the next level of your life i pray for you in your dream in your sleep through visions may those ideas be revealed to you Help them, please. I want to pray for students now. The kind of exams you have never written in your life, the kind of CGPA, the kind of breakthrough, take it now. Take it now. Take it now. Take it now. Help them. Take it now. Take it now. Hear me. Every spirit that makes you blank when you are writing exams, it comes under fire now. It comes under fire now. Whoever is holding your breakthrough, the key to the next level of your life, 
in the name of Jesus between now and the next miracle service they must look for you I prophesy it they must look for you hear me you will not look for them they will find their way and look for you I pray for you everyone here who has developed his gift what you need is for God to send those who have what it takes to honor it I pray for you listen hear me there is a way you can preach before men who don't need your grace they will rubbish your ministry and make you look like an idiot there is a way you do business in the presence of those who don't even have what it takes to value what you carry but I'm praying for you there is an unction that directs men only to those who can pay for what they carry Rabbi, help him help him help him help him help him help him in the name of Jesus that grace may that anointing direct you right now right now right now right now right now right now everything that has refused to grow here whatever God has given you that has refused to grow in the name that is above all names I command it to grow now I command it to grow now I command it to grow now let me speak over your finances many of you have given many of you have sown seeds but the harvest is being trapped somewhere I pray for you the force that releases the harvest of men I command that force to be at work for you now 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 hallelujah whatever covers your glory for men to see and bless you you are walking physically but it's Ichabod the glory is covered as a young lady you are beautiful but there's nobody to say I want to marry you I command that fail covering your glory be open now be open now be open now be open now arise shine arise shine arise shine hallelujah two more prophetic words and we're done it says and thou shalt hear a voice from behind saying this is the way in this season you need direction everything is not the way to go hear me please hear me there are people right now your bailout is to know what God wants you to do that he told you to do it yesterday does not mean he's still saying do it you need a fresh instruction I open your spiritual ears your sense of perception your sense of perception your sense of discernment be open now be open now finally I pray for you everything that is upon this ministry is supposed to show in your life so if there is honor honor is when God positions men who discern what you represent and openly celebrate it it's called honor honor is not something you lobby for it's not a political position he said you shall call the sons of Aaron and you shall take some of your honor and give them Joshua sorry I want to pray for you listen do you know what honor is let me tell you the truth honor is better than money money can give you things 
but it may not give you honor honor is when men can rise up and fight for you because they want to preserve what you represent it's called honor he says and Jabez was more honorable than his brethren there are people who do not have honor in their life let me tell you how you know there is no honor in your life there is no helper honor is when men can stand before you and say before you touch him you must touch us honor when a ministry does not have honor you beg for everything you pay for everything you explain everything honor is when men god puts men at the gates to plead your cause you are there praying and somebody is clearing any bad air about you any bad impression about your ministry there is always a voice to say no the hand of god is upon them it's called honor i pray for you what has made you fight alone when things go wrong you explain alone nobody to help you listen this is not about prosperity this is about the ministry of men i have seen this in my life there is such a thing called the gift of men where god will raise men strangely everywhere you go that there must always be a man to advocate for you it's an unction otherwise whenever things go well or go wrong you pay for it by yourself whether things go bad or things go well you pay for it it's because that honor is not there are we together lift your hands i want to pray for you receive that prayer from the depth of your spirit because it will change your life the grace that god has put by covenant upon this house he said that i he entered a covenant with david that there will never be a man the throne will never lack a man i pray for you at every point of your life those who must arise for you i bring them into your life through the mantle of honor through the mantle of honor may that anointing come upon you now let it come upon you now in your going out in your coming in be honored be honored listen everywhere you enter that grace that distinguishes men let it come upon you hallelujah jesus will bless you jesus will lift up your name jesus will lift up your name oh, jesus will lift up your name yeah. jesus will lift up your name give us five minutes please everyone no moving around there are people here who need to give their lives to Christ. Hear me. The Bible says that this is a testimony that God has given us eternal life and that this life is in his son. Please pay attention, concentrate, no moving around. It says he that has the son has eternal life. There are two groups of people right now. I want you to rush out here quickly. Those who have never committed their hearts to Jesus. You have never at any point in your life surrendered totally. I don't care how many times you have come for altar call. You have not made a genuine decision for Jesus. Number two, there are those who have given their lives to Christ. But the pressures and the vicissitudes of life have pushed you to a point where you have derailed in your walk with God. And you are saying, man of God, I need restoration. Wherever you are, please don't waste our time. Our time is gone. The Lord is calling you right now. And I want you to make a genuine commitment. Rise up and walk to the front right now. Rise up and walk to the front right now. Inside and outside. God bless you. People are coming. God bless you. People are coming. Please clear the way for them run like there's fire on the mountain in all the overflows all those following us online you may not be able to come out but prepare your heart to make this prayer with us god bless you god bless you god bless you go ahead and say today is the day i will make a decision for jesus there are still people god is asking to come out don't be ashamed make your way to the front no matter what you have done there is a new beginning for you you deserving of more. You deserving of more. You deserving of more. 
You're deserving of more. You're deserving of more. You're deserving of more. You're deserving of more. You're deserving of more. Hallelujah. Thank you so much for answering this call. I'd like you to lift your right hand to heaven. If you are still joining them, please make your way. It's not too late. We are not reciting a poem. This is a serious prayer that will determine your eternal destiny. Say after me very clearly. Say, Lord Jesus. Those online followers, say, Lord Jesus, I love you and I believe in you. I believe you died for me and you shed your blood for my sin. This night, I accept you as my savior and I receive eternal life into my spirit the power of sin and satan is broken over my life forever from today i'm a child of god i'm saved i'm born again in the name of jesus keep your hands lifted father thank you for these ones nobody can come except you draw them i pray that this that they have done as simple as it looks oh god i pray that this will be the reason for them to not only spend their eternal destiny with you but to live victorious lives here on earth in the name of jesus christ every power of the flesh of sin of satan is broken over your life from today you move forward ever and backward never in jesus name amen and amen thank you so much for hello scriptures exhort us from the book of proverbs it says my son attend to my sins Incline thy ears to my words. Let them not depart from thy eyes and keep them in the midst of thee. As you have listened to this message, we believe that you are going to reap the blessings thereof if you attend to these words as well. That you will keep these words in the midst of your heart. That no matter the circumstance, your eyes are going to be fixed on these words. And as you have been blessed, we will tell you to share this message. Be an evangelist by sharing to others to be blessed. And then subscribe to this channel for us because we have loads of videos. We have loads of content that is going to make you blessed. That is going to set you on course. That is going to set you ablaze. And don't forget to like for us. Thank you.